Hello, this is Sart with LSNTAP, giving you a roundup of this week in legal services technology. We've got some great stuff, an update on the hackathon from last weekend, games for good ideas, a free webinar that's going on next week, and some help with knowledge management. Let's jump right in here with the Legal Aid Virtual Hackathon that happened this last weekend. Awesome event. Big thank you out there to Joseph and to Abhijit for running a wonderful event. Really well done. Uh, we had over 30 participants uh, that I was aware of online at any time and some people came and went all weekend. I believe our registration was up over 50 or 60 people. There were a lot of different projects out there. Uh, super happy. I ended up getting second place in the hackathon for a privacy policy best practices. I'll have a separate video on that at a later point in time. But the idea is to look at what's going on with everybody rewriting their privacy policies with regard to uh, what's been going on recently in Europe and coming up with best practices for anybody who's writing a privacy policy that are really going to protect users and then come up with a practical privacy policy anybody in legal services can use. Uh, the number one winning team, though, was the chatbot team that came up with a chatbot to help youth that were aging out of foster care. Really awesome idea. Uh, a simple chatbot that could be put onto a website or embedded in an application. Uh, the target audience for this was youth. They had practical resources as part of it, worked on the logic tree, and actually got the chatbot uh, working somewhat. Uh, once there is a full demo of that, I'm going to try to bring them in to do a video highlighting that overall. The next thing that we've got today is an article that Kat put together for our website on Games for Good. A few months ago, a local judge here in the Seattle area asked for examples of how games could be used in the civil service area or to help people. And Kat happened to be working on a spreadsheet for game jams, looking specifically at some of the games that have come out for good. This is really interesting to me, as you know from last week, we planned the Social Justice Game Jam here last year, and I've got some news coming up about one of those games in the future, but finding better ways to teach the law, to get people involved in learning about civics is really a passion of mine. And Ket has this wonderful spreadsheet that is available. Uh, the link is down there. You can also find it on the LSN Tap website, but it's got over 20 games that are really designed with this civics idea in mind or other purposes or with a mission as part of it. We've got a free webinar coming up next week. Laura Quinn, the former head and founder of Idealware, is doing a user experience webinar. It is free. All of our webinars are free. You can register over at the lsntap.org slash trainings portion of the website. We've got Rachel Harris from Ohio Legal Assistance Foundation and Dan Jackson of New Law Labs. Anybody who is creating content online or websites, portals, mobile apps, anything like that, I highly recommend checking out this webinar. Last thing is I'm highlighting a new resource that's been put up recently on LSN Tap this year. It's a knowledge management toolkit. It is a PDF that goes through all of the basic things that you need to know about knowledge management when trying to set up a brief bank or some type of a knowledge sharing system. Uh, I was one of the individuals who ended up being interviewed for this. This is a passion of mine is finding out better ways to share information internally. One of the big takeaways for me in this area has been that community doesn't create itself. You need some type of a manager. You need someone who is going to really own that project and champion it for people. It's an extremely practical guide. There are lots of worksheets and pieces for implementing, understanding the ways that you would use knowledge, the who should have control, who should have access, who should own it. So it's super practical. Definitely recommend checking it out over at lsntap.org. If there's anything that you would like to see on a future episode, things that you're doing, projects that are awesome that you want to share with the community, definitely contact me. I'm looking for content for this. And until next time, hack for justice.